Hey everybody, what's up? This is Crypto Cody, and I'm so excited to do another video for you guys. Guys, in today's video, we're going to be talking about Crypto.com and why I personally think it's one of the best investments you can make in the cryptocurrency world. In addition to that, guys, if you could please just like, subscribe, comment, hit that bell notification, that would mean the world to me, guys. Let's hop into this video. All right, guys, so let's hop into Crypto.com. Uh, quick disclaimer, just want to remind you guys that, you know, I'm no financial advisor, so anything that I say is solely for entertainment purposes only. Make sure that you guys are fully responsible for any of your financial actions and what you guys do after this video. Um, but I just wanted to let you guys know, personally, this is one of my favorite cryptocurrencies, one of my favorite companies of all time. Um, you know, the founder, Chris, he did a phenomenal job and has pushed things in a big way. And Crypto.com is... Uh, probably going to become the leading cryptocurrency exchange in the entire world uh, in 2022. And I have a lot of reasons why I believe that. Um, it, it is already becoming one of the top leaders in the world. And it's just the way that they're advertising and marketing themselves. You know, you got to understand um, that crypto.com has done things completely right as far as how to market their marketing strategies. And let me give you a quick little example of that. Wall Street Journal just put this out. Crypto.com will run its first Super Bowl ad um, <clears throat> which is unbelievable. I mean, you, think about that for a second, guys. How many people do you think watch the NFL Super Bowl? How many people do you think watch that? Um, you know, we have hundreds of millions of people that watch that. And uh, Crypto.com has just, you know, as you guys know, um, now basically sponsored this one arena. They, have, they are now the Crypto.com Arena, all right, which is just, you know, so now there's this physical advertisement that people are going to see all the time with that. But this is just a genius, genius idea. And, you know, to be able to do this, um, this kind of advertising. So you have a big arena, Crypto.com Arena. They're going to be doing their first Super Bowl ad. All right. And then in addition to that, you also have, um, you have famous celebrities like Matt Damon who are pushing the cryptocurrency um, agenda. Actually, see Matt Damon front and center. Um talking about cryptocurrency which is you know now you got celebrities you got the face of you know faces that people know and recognize pushing agendas like crypto.com so let's dive into this really quick i want to talk about this is the other reason why that you know and, and i might be preaching to the choir on a lot of things here you know a lot of people will probably already know this stuff but for the newcomers you know this is a fresh video uh for 2022 oh by the way merry christmas everybody really excited I uh, hope you guys had an awesome, awesome Christmas uh, like myself. It was just awesome being able to spend time with the family. And we're just chilling right now. We just opened a bunch of presents. I decided, you know, I'm going to smoke a cigar, uh, talk about one of the, th the things that I love in this world, which is, you know, cryptocurrency and whatnot. But, you know, I want to remind you guys to just spend time with your family. You know, this life is all about family, friends. You know, for me, it's about God. It's about all these things that are important to us. And, uh, you know, cryptocurrency, this is just a beautiful way for us to be able to create an income, you know, extra incomes to be able to spend it on the things that matter, like our families and our friends. So anyways, all right, that was my little touchy Christmas thing for you guys. <laughs> um, so let's talk about these cards. So for those of you who don't have any cryptocurrency cards, uh, this is where I would definitely get started. Um, if you don't have a Coinbase card, we can do another video about that sometime. But I would highly recommend the Crypto.com card uh, debit cards. So we got the Midnight Blue. If you guys just want to kind of get your feet wet and start off without, you know, any obligation, staking obligations, which we'll get to that in a moment. Uh, zero percent or zero money down on staking. You just uh, you get a one percent back uh, cash back every time you spend money with this card. So um, that's that. That was the first one that I got when I first got my feet wet, and it was awesome. I loved it. Um, and then the next one is called the Ruby Steel. Now, this is an actual metal card. Uh, the blue one is not. That is a plastic card. But this is a. Uh, the rest of the cards that we're going to look at from here on out are all metal, which is pretty cool. It's exciting. This is the Ruby Steel. Now, you have to stake um, CRO in order to get this card. And according to this, it says that you need to stake up to six months, $400 to get the Ruby Steel. Now, what are the benefits of the Ruby Steel? The benefits are that you get CRO rewards of 2% cash back every time you spend money that is on that card. Oh, and also guys, I want you to know that when you're staking your CRO, you are also getting back 
10% in CRO rewards um, in addition to what these cards offer. So just wanted to let you know that there's a 10% CRO uh, return on your staking options with these cards also. So that's just take that into consideration too, it's pretty cool. In addition to that, you also get a Spotify rebate. So the Spotify rebate, is an equivalent of $12.99, so if they ever go up in price, that's all you're gonna be getting. So it's not necessarily 100%, but it could be. So basically what you get is that 2%, and then you get that Spotify rebate. So, and that's what you get for the $400 staking of CRO for six months, which is awesome. I think it's a great option uh, for those of you who don't wanna be putting a whole lot of money into your card, but you still wanna get some good rewards. I would, pref I would encourage you to get that versus the Midnight Blue. Okay, that's just my opinion. So, um, then you get the Royal Indigo or Jade Green, which I personally think this is the best one if you guys can handle the staking option, okay? And basically, you have to stake, once again, um, add another zero. It's now $4,000 that you have to stake up for six months, okay? If you believe in CRO, this is something that you should do. If it's something you don't believe in, then you probably shouldn't do it. Um, but be totally responsible for whatever you do. Um, I had to add that in there again. <laughs> so CRO rewards now go up to 3%, which is amazing. Think about this, guys. How many debit cards do you guys know in this world give you a 3% cash back on all of your spendings? I don't know any of them, really. I mean, there might be some out there that you might with some banks, but I don't know any. I don't know any at all. You know, so um, it's usually credit cards that you have to get involved with. These are not credit cards. These are these are debit cards, which is really exciting. So, I mean, the, war the rewards get better. Spotify, you also get... Um, that rebate back. You also get um, a hundred percent on Netflix. Now that's only the equivalent of thirteen dollars and nineteen or ninety nine cents, which I think I'm spending like fifteen dollars on my Netflix, but I'm not sure. But anyways, still, needless to say, that's amazing to get that every month. That's an awesome value. Now here's where things get a little bit more interesting. Airport lounge access. Now that's only for one person uh, that you get access for. Okay, and that's basically it for that card. Um, you do also have ATM. <coughs> You have ATM withdrawal uh, options up to $800 for this one, and I think $400 for the Ruby. And then if I'm not mistaken, I think it's $200 for this one. Yes. So, so that's that. So Frosty Rose or Frosted Rose, a gold and icy white. This is when you start throwing in some serious money. You need $40,000 in staking for six months to get your 5% on this card as well as Spotify 100% reimbursement Netflix now you're getting into Prime 100% reimbursement Expedia up to 10% you get lounge plus one guest which is awesome and guys I don't know if you know what the airport lounge thing is but it's basically like there are so many different um, different lounges in all these different airports all throughout the United States and um, and other countries where there's a back room where you can get all you can eat food all you can drink drink while you're waiting for your um, while you're waiting for your plane to, to arrive or your jet to arrive, which is pretty cool. And so that gives you this, this gives you the option to have plus one guest. Whereas, uh, this one up here, the Indigo or Jade Green gives you access or basically it's just for one. Okay. So that's a pretty cool option. Now you also have uh, crypto.com private. This is something that you definitely would want to be a part of. It's think of it kind of like a backroom option for the crypto.com community. Um, it's definitely something that I would want to be a part of. Earn bonus rewards, some pretty sweet bonus rewards. Exclusive uh, merchandise welcome pack, uh, pretty awesome. And that's that. And then you also have an ATM withdrawal of $1,000 month to month, which is pretty awesome. Then we finally have the big boy. Um, this is the black. You need to stake $400,000 USD to get this card, but it is definitely very rewarding for the amount of staking. Um, so you basically have 8% cash back, uh, which is phenomenal. It's just absolutely phenomenal. Uh, Spotify, Netflix, Prime, Expedia, 10%. Airbnb, 10%, which is pretty cool. You get the lounge plus one guest, crypto.com private, earn bonus rewards, exclusive merchandise welcome pack, and now you're a part of the private jet uh, package deal. I mean, guys, in the end, this is personally what I would love to get myself. Um, I think that this is the equivalent, like the black card. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of the black card, but it's to me like the equivalent of that. I think that, you know, as far as, as far as, um, you know, debit cards go, I think this is a phenomenal option. Uh, it's just pretty cool. It's awesome. 
So anyways, um, you know, I think that, you know, if you're just getting started, these, one of these two, I think are great options if you can handle it uh, financially. I mean, if you're going to be holding $4,000 plus dollars in CRO or $400 plus dollars in CRO, you might as well stake it, you know? Now you have the option to stake it with, you know, annually where you're getting 18% back or you can do the 6% to at least, or the six months to at least get one of these cards. So anyway, so those are the cards. Um, now, we talked about the cards, we talked about uh, the arena, we talked about, you know, the way that they've been marketing themselves. Let's talk about the rank. So the rank and the numbers. So it's number 15 right now, which is phenomenal. It's done such a wonderful job. It's up to 65 cents to the USD value. Um, it is seen above, uh, let's see what its all-time high is actually, I'm curious. I think its all-time high was almost a dollar. So, you know, I, I think for sure we're going to definitely be going back to seeing that. Now, will we see it this year? I don't know. Um, you know, I, I, I'm leaning towards believing that we're going to be seeing it this year. Uh, there's talk about us going into a bear market and seeing a 2018 again, you know, but who knows? Who knows? Um, I'm not really under that belief necessarily because, you know, and we can get into this on another video, but we're in the in institutional investor stage. Crypto.com specifically is in, you know, is trying to dive into, you know, let's get past the institutional investor stage. Let's start getting the moms and pops involved. Um, because, you know, collectively, the moms and pops have a tremendous amount of money that they can invest as a whole, just as much as institutional investors can also invest as well. So, you know, you got the crypto.com price, 65 cents, which I think is a good option for buying in. I think that we might, you know, see it go down a little bit here soon. But, um, yeah, it's, it's just, you know, you got something that's, you got something that's, you know, at, you know, 30 billion uh, CRO and max supply. Um, you know, I give you kind of guys, I'll give you guys a little example of why I think that this thing can just explode in an exponential way. Let's take a look at Cardano for a moment. ADA has 45 billion in supply. All right. So that's 15 billion more than what CRO has. And it's already sitting at a dollar 44. Now let me get, let me go the extra mile. What's the all time high with ADA? All time high is $3 and 10 cents. So what does this mean? This means that I believe, especially once we start mainstreaming CRO, okay, and, and we're going to, you know, and, and we are starting to mainstream CRO, but once we start, uh, once we start mainstreaming CRO, I think that this price could easily go between $3 to $5 um, because the max supply, okay, the max supply we've already now shown is much, much less than the max supply of ADA. It's $15 billion less, all right? That's that's a crazy amount less. And um, so that leads me to believe that, you know, we will more than likely see a dollar CRO and beyond, potentially between three to $5. And I think over the next five to 10 years, this thing could easily go to $15. I mean, depending on how much, you know, I mean, we gotta start seeing this market cap right here way past two trillion. That market cap needs to be a multi-trillion dollar market cap, a double digits trillion market cap. I mean, like, we're talking like above gold. You know, I think gold is at like 10 trillion right now. So if we're sitting at a $10 trillion cryptocurrency market cap, I would not be surprised. I mean, we'll think about it. That's a 5X from our market cap. So then we would basically, you might as well call that a 5X on 65 cents, right? So 65 cents times five, it's $3.25. So to me, there's no reason why Okay, and I think that it will hit it before this, but if this is sitting at a $10 trillion market cap, which is very possible in the next five to 10 years, for sure, I believe, um, we could see this sitting anywhere between three to $10. All right, that's just my opinion as far as, you know, long-term price prediction goes. I think it's very possible to see this hit a dollar and beyond uh, this year. And uh, not to be overly bullish, I just, you know, I, I'm, I'm only saying this because of things like this, guys. When you got stuff like this happening, crypto.com arena, Super Bowl ads, you know, your average people are going, this is a gateway. This is crypto.com is an exchange and it is a gateway to the world of cryptocurrency. Um, and it's a good gateway because it has a lot of options for different cryptocurrencies that you can buy um, or crypto assets that you can buy. But it also has, you know, you, you guys can do Apple Pay with this. I mean, check this out, guys. Look at this. I actually have crypto.com Apple Pay, which is freaking awesome. Do that. So I just want to encourage you guys and remind you guys that this is definitely a phenomenal option um, for you guys to be 
getting involved with, I think, as far as uh, cryptocurrencies go. You know, there's, it's going to continue to just come out with more big news. The way that they advertise and market themselves is just off the charts. So anyways, that's my quick little update on crypto.com. You know, oh, I did want to share with you guys one other thing too. Um, right now we're experiencing some technical difficulties with topping up money directly from our bank accounts with crypto.com. Don't know why. Um, I did talk to a representative about it and they were saying uh, something. It was really interesting. They were actually saying that they couldn't answer any of my questions as to why that was happening. Um, so it leads me to believe, and I, of course this is solely an assumption, but it leads me to believe that there is some things that are going on that they're going to be doing with the network that they're changing right now. Um, could be adding more cryptos. It could be some big news that's going to be coming out. I don't know. But the point is, is that you might not be able to experience topping up your crypto.com card directly from your debit card or bank account card, but you will be able to um, purchase like USDC and then top it up with that or any of the other topping up options that you can use. Um, unfortunately, though, there is a 3% um, fee every time you buy cryptocurrency. So that kind of eliminates that cashback reward options. So, you know, take that into consideration. Maybe talk to um, maybe talk to a representative uh, with, with crypto.com. Um, at least I've been having a hard time experiencing uh, topping up money. So, you know, they just take that into consideration and see what's going on. Uh, the representative did say come back in the next few days, which the few days would be tomorrow for me. So I'm going to go check it out tomorrow and see how that goes. But anyways, just a little side note. Hope you guys have an awesome day. Make sure to grab my crypto.com referral link in the description below. I will leave that for everybody to use. And I hope you guys have an awesome, awesome Christmas and Happy New Year. Crypto Cody out. Yeah.